Moldworks can be used to create a mold base from scratch or as a set of tools for a partially created or a legacy mold created in SOLIDWORKS or read in through an external file format. In this video we show the creation of a standard insert mold from scratch. First we set the mold coordinate system to be at the center of these two insert instances. Next we add the inserts to the mold in order to find an optimal mold size. We designate the core and cavity sides as well as some pre-prepared tools to cut spaces for the inserts in the core and the cavity place after they have been created. We can add slides to the mold once it has been created. However, we can also add them before creating the mold from a standard slide library which can include user-defined slides as well. We choose the suitable configuration from our, for our slide and the face onto which it will connect. Since we cannot know in advance the pin length, we define the actual stroke, the distance, that the slider must move. And the system will create the pin length according after the bolt plates are built. Here the slide is added to the other three faces as well. We now start the new mold menu which allows us to define the standard or non-standard mold base according to the catalog we select and the different options which become available depending on the catalog selected. In the second tab we can see the estimation data to help find the optimal catalog size and an injection machine display area to see which injection machine is suitable. This data is user customizable for your own factory injection machines. The new mold is creating using SOLIDWORKS sketches to control the plate assembly which is then created. Mates and equations to make sure that the mold structure is coherent and can be easily modified downstream are formed. This is a huge benefit if modifications to the mold structure are to be made at a later date. Next the components and component holes are created and the positioning sketches as well. Finally, we create the pockets for the inserts and slides, which were added prior to the mold creation. All geometry is standard SOLIDWORKS, so that you are not tied to MoldWorks at any point of the design process, and can use SOLIDWORKS menus freely at any stage without corrupting the MoldWorks data.